So in this extended version of the video, I'm gonna go into how we grew our business into 150 weddings per year. So really, this is the more detailed stuff. It's probably more suited to people who are shooting, you know, 20 to 30 weddings per year and really wanna grow past that point. So with Google Ads, it's a bit of a taboo subject because you can waste a lot of money. Um, we've got friends in the wedding industry who have spent, you know, five to $10,000 a month uh, and they really haven't seen any uh, results at all. So I really don't recommend you set up your own Google AdWords campaign because you really can just waste a lot of money. It's totally possible. Um, if, even if you spent, you know, let's say $5,000 a, a day or something like that, that's not a guarantee that you're going to get a lot of traffic and a lot of leads to your website. So some people won't get value unless you go to a PPC, pay per click a Google AdWords specialist. Um, so we went with a firm in Sydney in our local city. Um, they set things up pretty much perfectly. Um, it usually takes around about three months to really start to see um, results. And I think at the time we were spending about $1,200 a month on Google ads. Um, and then we really started to see results probably after a month or two. Um, but they said that we wouldn't see results um, up to until three months. You can Google different specialists in the area. Um, there will be some people who are kind of like no win, no fee. So if you don't really see any results, I don't think you get charged. So maybe go with one of those people. Uh, whatever you do, make sure you're not being signed up to a contract. Um, some people will say, look, um, you have to be with me for six months before or you can cancel. Um, so definitely don't go with those people because if you're not seeing results, just get rid of them. So this is the other really massive thing. Try to make sure that when you sign up with one of these specialists, um, that if you don't want them anymore and you say goodbye, that they're going to let you keep your Google Ads campaign which means that they'll have gone through your Google Ads um, setup, set everything up for you, all the right targeting and all that kind of stuff. And if you get rid of them, you still get to keep that campaign. So that's actually what happened with us. Um, they were charging us way too much money every single month just to manage our campaigns. So we actually said goodbye to them. Uh, the best thing was we had negotiated that if we said goodbye to them, we'd still get to keep all of the campaigns and data. And so we've actually kept that um, to this day which is almost three years later or something like that. That's been a massive way that we've grown our company um, and it's really scalable. So this is the thing that pretty much no one knows about, but it's honestly, it's critical. If you're gonna be spending any money online on Google ads or anything like that, you have to have a landing page. So um, a lot of old school people will say, you don't need a landing page. Just send all that traffic, all those interested people straight to your homepage. And that might be okay if your homepage is set up perfectly to be a landing page, but 99% of people's homepages aren't. So it's really important to send everyone who's slightly interested. Um, they've clicked on your ad, clicked on Facebook or Instagram or on Google. They should be getting sent to a landing page. So a landing page is essentially a page where people go to it and there's enough information, there's enough enticing images, etc., that people think, oh, like I, I really am interested, let me enter my details. And the best thing is that once you have those details, then you can contact that person. So I'd recommend having an automatic email that goes out with your pricing, etc., cetera, um, and then maybe following up with a phone call as well. So the really cool thing about landing pages is that usually it's a series of images, a little bit of copy saying, hey, you know, this is what we're all about, this is what we do, have a look at our best images, our best videos, and that kind of thing. Um, but critically, there's not uh, a menu on that page. So if they're interested, essentially what's gonna happen is they're gonna go to the page, they're gonna be hyped up to the point where they get to the bottom of the page and they think, oh, well, I'm excited about this, I'm gonna put in my details. But if they want to go to your about page or your home page, there's no menu at the top. So have a look at the best landing pages and it's really easy to Google and make sure the landing page you create is just like that. So the typical landing page converts at something like uh, 3%. So 3% of people go to that page and they think, oh, I'm really interested. I'm going to leave my details in the form. And that means you can contact them back but our landing page was converting at, I think 15% and at 1.20%. So 20% of all the people who saw our ad on Facebook or Instagram or on Google would come to this page and give us all their details. 
and that was a massive reason why we were able to grow so quickly. So the other really important thing is uh, not related to landing pages, it's not related to any of that other stuff. I'm actually planning my own wedding in a few months, so it's really awesome because I've been able to go through all these different people's websites, and then I get to the About You page because I wanna see who I'm gonna be dealing with. I wanna see if my personality matches, I wanna see if this person is a crackhead who's smoking meth or something, I just want to make sure they're not weird or whatever. And I go to the About Us page and there's no picture of the person who owns the business. There's no picture of the person who I'm going to be dealing with. And I think a really important thing that we've done on our page is that when you go there, um, there's a little blurb about us. I'm telling you the story of how we got started. There's a picture of both Max and I, uh, the people that generally you're going to be getting on your wedding day. Um, and one of the things that I've really been slacking off with is recording an About Us video so that people can really see the personality that we have um, and see if we're a good mesh for them on their day. So these are the really big tips that have helped us grow our business into 150 weddings per year. I really hope this was useful for you guys. Um, I'm sure you're going to have some questions, so just leave those in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer every single one of you. If you haven't already, please do hit subscribe, it really helps me out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.